Hello and welcome. This is Jit Dovek and you are watching It's Tomorrow News. Hurricane Lorenzo, another strongest ever recorded. The much diminished remains of what was when Hurricane Lorenzo hit southern Germany on Saturday. On the Zugspreiz mountain, Germany's highest peak, winds reached 108 km per hour in a blizzard. But on lower ground, in areas where most people live, it was merely a wet and windy day. Five days earlier, Lorenzo was a Category 5 hurricane, the strongest ever recorded in the central North Atlantic with winds blowing at 259 km per hour. It generated waves of 15 meters but with occasional rough waves of 30 meters. The swell spread of both sides of the ocean to the joy of surfers. The first land to be affected by Hurricane Lorenzo was Portugal's western Orizo. Waters around this island are not warm enough at less than 22 degrees Celsius to sustain a hurricane so Lorenzo was already declining. However, it was still at category 1 on the Sefer Simpson scale of hurricane strength when its eye passed about 80 km to the northwest of the western Mon Azores. The islands of Corvo and Flores came with the band of hurricane force winds and 0.5 meter storm surge on Wednesday. Trees and electricity lines were brought down while damaging waves were measured at 17 meters. There is no history of such violent conditions over this island in 125 years of records. On the island of Flores, the commercial harbor of Lejar de Flores suffered badly. Everything not portaled down to the concrete quay was swept away while containers littered the shoreline. The Azores Islands are not strangers to hurricanes. Indeed, there have been at least 14 recorded since 1893. But only one has made landfall as a Category 2 hurricane in 1926. Over the top of the capital on Sao Miguel Island, the largest of the Azores archipelago. The cyclone fairly raced away to the northeast across the ever coolest water towards Ireland. Extratropical cyclone Lorenzo hit country Donegal and Northern Ireland late on Thursday. On the way, Lorenzo blew at 108 km per hour over mess head country Galway. Rain fell for at least 18 hours over Northern Ireland. A steadily weakening storm prompted the UK Met Office to issue flood warnings. The still notable storm crossed the low countries and Germany and was still recognizable as a low pressure area late on Sunday over Ukraine. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news. Jit Dolakya. For more weather updates like this, please subscribe to our channel.